Hello everyone, welcome back to more Europa Universalis 4, I am Bob Mod. Mm. Things are happening around the world, things do happen. <laughs> we are we are expanding though quite nicely. Mm -hmm. Soon we will have our very own Australia. Quite nice, I know. Though the dreaded Brits. Oh. Yes. Well, it's, that's fine, I suppose. Mm -hmm. uh, we have many colonies. We've got this this little Colombian colony. Um, some land here. It's the uh, the northern parts that we really have the most territory. The northeast here, we've got some strong presence going on. Yes. Also, I have to take a loan, I'm afraid. Oh, so expensive. 3% interest. Ah! Uh, just. Ah! Uh. Mm, good. Mm -hmm. 95 a year. I wish I had more. How are you guys doing? Good, good. What's this? A lucrative trade. 10 ducats. 20 diplomatic power. Mm -hmm. I'll take the ducats for now. Russia, Canada recently completed a, a small tiff with Nova Scotia. Gaining land. I know. I was quite pleased with it too. Mm -hmm. So have to expand a little more. And they can start to eat some of these nations. I know. It would be delicious. Perhaps I'll... Ooh, I should take... Oh, it's a protectorate of England. Bah! Bah, I say. California. Oh, yeah. California. Why? Sure, I'll accept. All right. Russian Sonora e Sino Sinola. Okay. Sonora e Sonora. All right. So we've got some weird territory going on here. I hope to expand into here, but it's just I never have enough colonists. And they are expensive, you know. I'm going to recall this guy so I can send a new colonist quite soon. I'm going to send him down Yeah. Now, where are my other guys? Here, that's acceptable. Here. Oh, I'm going to move down here if that's going to be how that is. <laughs> Unhappiness among the artisans. Abolish attacks. Lose stability. Mm. I'll take the stability hit. 42. Wow. That doesn't cost much. I'm going to pay that. There we are. Two stability. The Haida. I feel like I should destroy the Haida quite soon. And two. Naval supplies. Hmm. Let me take a look at this. No, uh, nope. No, uh, there we are. One, two, three, four. I think I'll need one more piece of land. So we'll call from here. And we'll go with. There. Yes. Perfect. Saxony doing its thing. Oh, that's fine. We pay my loan. I'll leave it be. Loans are paid. So I'm poor again. And that's fine. Now then. We have a situation. 
where I would like to eat Denmark. Ah, oh, Russian Australia. Oops. Ah, oh, damn it. Oh, well, you know what? Russian Australia is an acceptable name. I am happy enough with that. No. Nationalism, eh. They are, they are part of my glorious empire. You, they're totally part of my empire. Good old loyal Australia. Mm -hmm. uh, they still want me to conquer Eastern Poland. So yeah, kind of have this choice. I can eat Lithuania more or Brandenburg more. France, Hamburg, and the Netherlands. Hmm. Hmm. However, the Brandenburg does have the superior military fleet, which upsets me. However... I can, f I can move my own forces, filling this region with soldiers in preparation of my own invasion of Brandenburg. What's this? And a bunny? Uh, let's see. Red-haired and with a fiery temper, the pirate Anna Bonnie was couched together with her second husband, Jack Calico Jack Rackham. Uh, the pirate soup, Revenge. Uh, they fought Jonathan Barnett's troops fiercely, but had to admit defeat as their crew was too drunk to fight. Uh, that's a shame. He was hanged because her pregnancy was granted. Okay, her son and uh, plaguing the Caribbean. Gain a super awesome advisor or... Admiral, the winning stone to keep an eye. Hmm. Akia, eh? Hello, Akia. Um. I'll take the advisor option. And a buddy. Hmm. Yeah, well, I have a lot of income, but I'm curious to see how much it'll drop once um once that hits. Oh, seems like somebody's decided to phone me. Ah. Just ignore it, everybody. Nothing to hear here. Nah, here, here. Alright. I have been spending... I've been building... Universities, I believe. No, I want to build a university here. So that's what I'm going to do. University! Yeah. University. Right, so then, yeah. Super cheap to improve those. At least three points. Hmm. Val, get that university built. Hmm. Um, and build a university there, too. Yes. Very good. See, I think once this war with Brandenburg is over... Let's see. Reconquest, yes, for Denmark. Lots of land that I can take back. Uh... Oh, no. Ah, that's fine. I'm gonna... F once this place is finished, I can move them there. And that's almost finished. It's just a matter of colonizing these regions to piss off the Brits. I think we'll take that one first because it has slightly better land. There we are. Now you can get over there. That's another small boost to my dear, dear Russian Canada. Now, back to what I was plotting. Let's see, yeah. Diplomacy, declare war. Hmm. Austria is 5,000 ducats in debt. Well, that's just embarrassing. Aragon, 3,000 ducats in debt. You people. 
guess I'll take her. Since 10 is, is a fairly affordable, really. You can go there. Even without them, though, I've got these two vassals who will be able to join the war. Which I think might be enough. Especially because they will be so ravaged. Oh, what do we got? Um, the burgers. Decentralized. Oh. Well, that'll cancel out the territory bonus I got. So, yeah. Uh, delegate to the provinces. The burgers can get some some stuff. And you can do that. Yes. Yes. Everything is starting to come together in a glorious scheme. Portuguese Mexico. Okay. Hmm. This will be good. I like I like where this plan is going. We'll make Denmark our super best friends again. And they'll love us so much. Yes, I know. I my religious stuff lets me fight just virtually anyone. Anyone I would I could possibly want to punch in the face. Right. All right. So thirty-two. I'm going to recall and expand some more. Uh, ooh, that's a good choice. Where do I want to? Well, I guess we will go send somebody here. That's good land. Three deckers. You know what? I'm going to do it. Uh, naval morale increased. Naval maintenance increased. But we do have the three-decker ship now. And I would like to upgrade these. Building more three-deckers. That's a good start. Um, still, I could have a little more expansion going on. Hmm, but, but where do I want to send it? Um, oh, I know. I've got my idea. Uh, where is it? So I'm going to go to... Nope. Nope. Barcelos. Recall him. Let's fill up these gaps. For too long has these gaps existed. In Russia. We must fix it. Post haste. Posty hasty. And... Oh, can I... I can threaten you. Oh, I can. No worries. I'll do that. Uh, where's Lower Isham? There you are. Mm. Okay, take that territory. Which will serve me well. Um, Manchu. I guess I should fabricate a claim on them. Just so I have something to do. Um, Kiragina. I'll do that. Move the fifth over here. Preparation of that. How's this war going? Gotta keep an eye on it. Gotta keep an eye out. England no longer a valid rival, are they? What well, a that's a shame. Oh, Portugal. Alright, so now you've got the university. Spend some stuff there. University. There we are. Getting more manpower. Mm. Oh, what is this? Rightful ownership. Of late, one of our subjects seems to be to remind the attention comes by owning land which they view as rightfully theirs. Um, give. Halogaland to Norway. Hmm. Alright, you know what? I will give it to them. They can have it back. I don't mind. I'm going to take it from them soon enough anyways. <gasps> Land maintenance down 10%. Oh. That's... 
When you when you when you yeah when you have a huge army like I do, you need you need to find ways to trim it down. And I'm glad I've done so. Hmm. We've got some solid income coming in. Ooh, with which I plan to. Yes. Two. Three. Four. A two year wait? Hmm. Yeah. I'll get some heavy ships under construction. I don't know how long this war is going to take. Yeah, they can take a while. So, might as well. Yes. Yes. And don't worry, dear Denmark. Soon Brandenburg will pay for their sins. So if I gather all of my fleets in one place before the war starts, I will be well positioned to destroy them. Oh. Um. Ah, perfect. So that got finished. I'm going to declare war colonialism. Colonial conquest. So that will send uh, my va my good yeah, well not only my vassals. Uh, yeah. Perfect. Send him there. So what'll happen is Russia will bring there should bring Um, you guys, why aren't you? Damn it, you. Oh, fortifications, good. I'm just like, why aren't you moving your armies down there, buddy? But I suppose they're doing a weird thing? What's this? Compensate the traders, gain mercantilism. I do want mercantilism. All right, all right. All right, let's... How long will this take? Because these only exist for go for a limited time. Ah, damn it, it won't work. Compensate the traders. I'll take the debt. I can always take loans. There we are. That's the, the stacks that I wanted to see. So I took a loan, which is fine. And send it to Ohio. Good. And he'll win the war for me. That's all I really wanted. Someone to win a war for me. Nine eight nine. That's solid. Could be a little bit better though. There we are. Yes, their army's quickly shattering. That's what I wanted to see. Ninety five. Ooh, put trade point. Visit from shady people, eh? Spy fence, eh? It's an offer we can actually refuse. Uh, no, 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 no. I'm going to conquer you. There we are. Hey, buddy. Welcome to be conquered, and give me all your money. Om nom 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 nom. More land for Russia. Now repay that loan. Imperialism against Normandy? Normandy exists? What happens? What's happening? Burgundy's back. Oh, France. The French region is a weird place. I think I want to stay out of it. It's a little too crazy for my liking. 
What do we got here? Shiny. Oh, look at you, Poland. You think you'll be able to hold on to that? I'm not so sure. Uh, there's some rather large rebel issues that can happen. But if you want to try. Either way, the Ottomans. Oh, the Ottomans are just collapsing under the weight of their own fat. Just a bunch of fatzos. Oh yeah, that reminds me. Uh, military. Uh, mothball the forts, because I don't need them right now. What's this? Full serfdom, eh? Tsar Alexis received a superficial education from his tutor Boris Ivanovich Morza before uh, seat of the throne at the age of 16. A superficial? That's terrible. Morozov, who was also Alexis's brother-in-law, initially took charge of state affairs, but in 1648, a popular uprising in Moscow forced Alexis into exile. Or forced him to exile Morozov. He vowed to the rebels' demands and conveyed a land assembly, which, uh, which in 1649 produced a new Russian code of laws, which legally defined serfdom. Hmm. Stability more expensive, but more manpower for ten years. Or, unrest and production down for 10 years. Mm. Eh. Eh. Well, first off, where's Kaffa? Kaffa. 30 noble regiments, eh? Hmm. Hmm. Do I want to... Do I want to fight 30 noble regiments, or do I just not care right now? Hmm. You know what? Let's enforce it. We'll enforce the serfdoms. It seems acceptable to me for the moment. Hmm. Lithuania has declared a war on Sweden. That's fine. I'll punch them soon enough. I'm going to shave that down a touch. I think I went overboard on my colonies, didn't I? Yeah, six colonies is one too many. Hmm. Barcelos has naval goods. That's nice. Who will finish first? Hochlaga, probably. All right. Mm, yes. The Hinnewick. All right, I could probably conquer them. Which will put me into range of attacking the fox. Uh, nope, nope. I help. I help out whenever there's trouble. Our Isham is part of our patrimony. Good. Let's absorb it. Let's make sure we're construct a grand fleet. Eh, I'm kind of working on that. I have more equal heavy ships than twenty. Hmm. We're gonna take a break. That's what we're gonna do. Come back soon. See if we can figure out. Uh, ooh. Well, I suppose we'll have to go pick a fight with Cologne, maybe. Or finish conquering Brandenburg. One of the two. Talk to everybody in a bit.